G'day folks, it's Rico here with another great easy tip. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to set up the kitchen on your easy trail camper trailer. To access your kitchen, you'll need to drop this drawer down and we've got two little bolts here that are holding the kitchen in. So we need to go ahead and undo those. All right, with our latches released, now we can go ahead, grab the top handle and gently slide the kitchen out. There we go, and that'll stop exactly when it's out. So the next step is to get the leg from underneath and we'll drop that down and that's gonna support the weight of our kitchen. So the next step is to drop down the stabilizing support leg. You'll find a catch underneath here and there's a small button on the end of it. Push that out, drop it away. Okay, so now that we've got our leg down, what we need to do is adjust it to take the weight. A couple little butterfly bolts there that allow that to slide down. And what I like to do is just take the weight of the kitchen and then just nip those up. She's ready to rock and roll. How good's that? Next up, we can go ahead and get our little bit of extra bench space ready. Now, you'll notice that by itself, it's reasonably strong, but there is a bit of give there. So if you plan on using this for a bit of weight, like a plate full of steaks or something good like that, Easy Trail have provided a solution and that's this leg here. So there's a slot in the top that's gonna to sit just under the edge there. So we'll unlock it. Take the weight, lock it in. Absolutely rock solid. All right, now with everything firmly locked into place, we can begin the setup of the kitchen itself and we'll start here with the burners. The lid comes up, we've got a couple of very handy windshields. They slide up, come back down, same on the other side. And they lock into the holes there. And that way you're protected from the wind while you're trying to get some, uh, some tucker going. To get our sink ready for use, it's as simple as just lifting up the drainer. Now you've got a perfect little spot to put all your condiments for cooking or all your gear while it's drying after you've done the washing up. Pretty handy, isn't it? Now it's time to get some power to the kitchen. And you need to come and grab this little plug here and pop it into one of these little power sockets. Just like that. All you need to do now to get the power in is press the light button and there you go. To get our gas connected, we need to come around to the back of the kitchen and find the access point here. And this is where you'll find the gas hose. Once you've located the gas hose, go ahead and pull it out until you come up with this. This is the bayonet fitting that you're going to put into the gas supply line. Underneath the back of the trailer, you'll find this bayonet fitting here. Give it a push, a twist, and pop it out. That's your dust cover out of the way. Grab your bayonet fitting, line him up. You might have to give it a wriggle, push it all the way home, give it a twist, and then it's locked in. Now your gas is ready to rock and roll. Now we can go ahead and remove our little foam stove protectors. Now here's a handy tip. Don't throw these away. These are perfect for keeping everything in place while you're traveling. Now it's time to get your Easy Trail sink ready for use. Located directly under the sink, you'll find this drain hose. You can pull this out, extend it out, and throw a bucket under there or straight to the ground, whatever suits your purposes, and there's your drain ready to go. Now a sink is not much good to us without water and we can see here that our rear tank has got plenty left in it. Now to access that, all we need to do is go ahead and hit the pump button. Well, there you have it, folks. Your Easy Trails Gourmet Kitchen is set up and ready to cook up a storm. Now, for more great tips and tricks, hints and hacks, and things that I picked up from towing Easy Trails all over the countryside, make sure you head to Easy Trails Facebook page, give that a like, and while you're online, why don't you go over to YouTube, subscribe to the channel there, and don't forget to hit the bell icon, that way you'll be notified when new videos come up. Easy Trail, they really are making camping easy.